Hello and welcome to another Geeks Tech screencast. Today I'm very happy to say I've launched a new website and it's called Tech Q and A, which is Tech Questions and Answers. Uh, it's your source to Tech Questions and Answers. Uh, it's very good. Uh, site this is going to be hopefully uh, it's community based run uh, what that means is you the user are basically in charge uh, what you do is basically you sign up you post a tech question maybe you're stuck on doing something to do with technology maybe you don't know how to do something in windows or in or in a mac or you're wondering how a certain feature works on something on the video camera or one of your gadgets whatever every tech related and you ain't sure ask the question on here post the question then it's the community then that will respond with an answer saying you do it like this or yes this feature does this or no don't do that I recommend you doing this and so on and so on so it's all basically run by the community. It's the community that asks questions, it's the community that answers questions, the questions and answers are saved so people can do, uh, search. Which you can see there, there's a search bar. Just type in your search and you see if it's already been answered before you post. You can also search by tags and look up users and so on and so on obviously this is all to do with technology and tech questions and I, there ain't too many of these sorts about at the moment there's plenty of these sorts that's running yeah because it's this actual software is open source and it's it is actually called open source questions and answers um, so anybody can run this sort of website as you can see here but I haven't seen one yet that's running a questions and answers for technology and this is what I'm aiming for so obviously I've only just launched this there's no questions so I can't really show you that much on my site at the moment but it's just one for a few things. You got like questions, you tags, which will list all tags. Users, I've got oh, one, two, three. Oh, I've got four users signed up apart from what well, three because on Geeks Tech. Uh, Karma, recent, uh, oldest by username. So you can search like that. Badges. Now you can uh, you get award badges uh, by uh, by your questions and answers and. Like people voting and so on. But here's the list of available badges which are awarded. Like uh, clean up, first rollback, editor, first edit. So if you post a question and you think, oh damn, I forgot to add something, edit your question and you are awarded with editor. Uh, so those are the list of badges available. Uh, and unanswered which lists unanswered questions then over actually let's go back to my son then here you got uh, ask a question then you got it tells you a list of number of questions and it will say uh, a number of answered questions as well um, basically a bit of uh, advertising revenue blah 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 there. Also at the bottom here it shows recent tags and recent badges which is all good good good. Uh, you got the uh, at the bottom of the page yeah you got about freaking questions privacy support contact us and powered by OSQA and I was there it is open source but some rights are reserved. Now I'm going to take you on to uh, the OSQA site that's running this where you can get uh, 
help with this piece of software just to show you on how it works a bit more so this is the website of OSQ8 which is what I'm running and as you can see it lists uh, questions like all down here right now you've got your uh, tags here you've actually the question headline now use names how long ago yeah I mean votes answers and views so I'm actually going to open this one up so here's the question the first question right with the tags and at the bottom is answers then just underneath here is where you can reply to that answer and other people can reply as well or they can post their own answer just by posting down the bottom here oh a bit too far here so it's pretty good you also get a, a nice little preview of what you're typing uh, here as well you got a vote up or vote down and uh, well because a favorite if you want as you can see I like this post and I don't like this post and so on a bit more info over here you know when was it asked how many times been seen the last update uh, if I go into the tags you can see there this list of tags and how many times that tags been specifically used uh, users go into there you can see a list of users badges is the same uh, un unanswered questions shows you there basically if they looks like some of them's just been answered we get the general idea on how uh, tech q and a is going to look in time because once it's got known it's going to fill it up and people can search for questions and answers on technology brilliant Susie brilliant of course tech uh, questions and answers is also part of geek sex so it's all good you can find your site at www.techqa dot co dot uk uh, I hope people recognize it and use it uh, just another thing to point out is if you uh, go to log in you can log in with Facebook Twitter Google Yahoo AOL and a few other ones down here like WordPress open URL or open LD URL or you can register so it's all good it's just basically as simple as click on ask a question type in the question Bob Sean well that's basically it then for Geeks Tech uh, this is a screencast showing you our new site called a Tech uh, QA your source to tech questions and answers which is at www.techqa.co.uk and as always you can follow me on Geeks Tech at www.geekstech.co.uk Twitter.com forward slash 4 Geeks Tech uh, You can search for us on Facebook, just search Geeks Tech Me.me forward slash Geeks Tech Then we've got YouTube.com forward slash Geeks Tech where you can subscribe to our videos and rate them and Then we've got the live 24 hour a day Video feed going out over the web at live.geekstech.co.uk And as always, got any questions or queries, feel free to email me at wayne at geekstech.co.uk Until the next time, see you later.